in the heart of the word. Reflections by Father Joseph Mary, SCTJM, on the daily readings from the Holy Mass, Monday of the 34th week of Ordinary Time, Memorial of Our Lady of the Miraculous Medal. God bless you, dear family. Today in the heart of the word, we celebrate the Memorial of Our Lady of the Miraculous Medal. On this day in the year 1830, Our Lady appeared to St. Catherine Labore in Rudebach, France, in a vision that would change history. In the apparition, Our Lady is standing on the world, crushing the head of the serpent, and is surrounded by the words, O Mary, conceive without sin, pray for us who have recourse to thee. Our Lady has rays of light coming from precious stones on her hands, which are pouring out graces on all of humanity. Then Our Lady revealed to St. Catherine Labore an image of an M intersected by the cross, and an image of the Sacred Heart of Jesus and her Immaculate Heart surrounded by 12 stars. My brothers and sisters, the Miraculous Medal is a triumph of the hearts of Jesus and Mary. Through this medal, Our Lady has caused conversions, healed lives, and formed Marian apostles for these times, like St. Maximilian Kolbe, who used the Miraculous Medal to build the City of the Immaculate wherever he went. In the apparition, St. Catherine Labore describes that certain stones did not have light coming from them. Our Lady explained that these represent the graces that people do not ask for. My brothers and sisters, have we forgotten that Our Lady is our mother, the surest path to the heart of Jesus? In our world that is so in need of healing, let us equip ourselves with this remedy for these times, this armor for our battles, and this weapon of love that has the power to conquer the world for the Immaculate, and through her, for the Eucharistic and Sacred Heart of Jesus. Let us listen to these words of Mother Adela. To build a Marian civilization, the only thing needed is a Marian army of apostles of the Immaculate. All for the heart of Jesus, through the heart of Mary.